now we'll see how to optimize our production how to produce at the optimum level how do we know if we are producing at the optimum level or no and if not how to reach the optimum level what is production optimization production optimization is nothing but the combination that we need to use of what of factors of production to do what to minimize the cost of production to reduce to cut to minimize the cost of production let's say i want to produce 100 units if i want to produce 100 units what is the proportion of factors of production that i need to employ to minimize my cost of production now please understand that all factors of production are employed at a cost land comes at a cost you pay rent for it labor comes at a cost you pay wages or salaries for it capital comes at a cost you pay interest for it and the risk taking ability also comes at a cost you pay profit for it so all the factors of production come at a cost so when we are producing something we need to incur cost but the important point here is how to reduce how to minimize that cost if we minimize the cost of production automatically the profits will increase either you will sell your product at a lower price which will increase your sales and increase your profit thereby or you can sell your product at the market price and earn a higher profit percentage in either case your profits will increase and this is what the businessman or the entrepreneur wants this is the motive of doing the business this is the motive of producing and selling goods that is to earn profit and for earning profit it is important that your costs are minimum your costs are minimal and this is what is the optimum production level how do you reduce your cost for producing your units by changing or getting a combination of factors of production for optimizing the production we have two devices at our disposal first is the isocons and second is the isocost lines now let's see what are isocons and what are iso cost lines <laughs> 